What's up? How you doing? I'm Richard Bird, and I'm here at the Alter Ego House. And today we're going to be talking about LED lighting. And I believe I got the guys from Green Torch upstairs messing around with the lighting, and I want to see what they're doing. So follow me. All right. This is going to look wonderful with the, uh, the terracotta colors going to match perfectly, I'm sure. There you go, it looks wonderful. Gary, Evan. How you doing? What's up, man? Hey, good hey. to see you. So I see you just got that screwed in. That is a bright light. Uh, it is. That yeah. is great. I, I can't believe it. I was, uh, I was a little bit worried about this LED stuff, and I'm telling you, looking at it right now, it looks amazing. LED is now at the point where you can use it in a general illumination process. Like, to get the warmth of colors, I mean, it's not typically associated with LED, but we're able to do that now. So you can match and tune the colors of the LED to the room. Yeah. And you only use 10% of the energy compared to halogen lighting. Yeah, that's amazing. Yeah. You know, one of the concerns, as you guys know, was our interior designer was scared of LED because she didn't think that the color would match what she wanted to. But you guys really came through and matched up the color for the room. Mm -hmm. I mean, this color is different than what I see in other rooms, like some of the closets. Is brighter. This is warmer, and I think even in the movie theater we did a different color. When you go to buy light bulbs, you'll see that there's a number on there. Um, that number talks about like the intensity of the light, and that's called the lumens. Okay. And when you determine how efficient a bulb is, you have to take the number of lumens it produces and the amount of watts that it takes to produce that. And so the benefit of LED is that it produces more lumens per watt than incandescent. And because it runs so efficient and it doesn't throw heat out, um, the bulbs last so much longer. So with this typical bulb, you'd expect to see an incandescent maybe 3,000 hours. You're looking at 50,000 hours with these. Unbelievable. So you'll never change them. And I'm standing right under the light and I'm not getting hot or sweaty. So. Right. And if, yeah. that was a, if that was a normal incandescent bulb. I'd be burning his fingers right now. You have people come in and they won't believe it's LED. That's what we're going for. We don't want you to know. We want you to see the light power and see the color quality and then find out that it's an LED. Yeah. So what else did you guys do here? Show me. So what we got out here is a landscape light. Um, it uses nine watts and you know it gives wonderful powerful light. It's equivalent to about 150 watt incandescent. So you're actually saving over 90% of the energy. 150 watts? It's got three LEDs in it and they're very narrow beams so it throws high up the tree so you don't get a lot of, uh, a lot of flood uh, illuminating areas that you don't want to illuminate. So. Uh, basically, you put it on a tree and it angled the right way and it looks absolutely amazing. It's like a paint stroke on a painting. Mm -hmm. You know, you want a nice upward light that's just falling its way up the trunk of the tree. That's what the light is designed to do. It's, it's called the Lumentera. So it, it, it lights the earth. This is great stuff, guys. Yeah. yeah. Let's get out of here. All right. It's hot. Let's yes, get out of here. Your lights are cool, but it's hot. <laughs> this is California. <laughs>